Let's take a look in this antique newspaper from 1820 to learn more about my favorite antique sport, pedestrianism. Fast walking. This is the Union Gazette, dated Tuesday morning, June 20th, 1820, Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. So this is before baseball. One of the biggest sports to take over the UK and then in the United States was pedestrianism. That's walking quickly from one place to another. It was, people would bet, they were star walkers of the era, both male and female. They were celebrities for walking quickly. A heel-toe method was developed and codified within this pedestrianism sport. Here is an article, or, or, or a little paragraph. I'll read. <clears throat> from the Salem Register, June 14th, 1820. Pedestrianism. A young gentleman of this town on Monday last started from Salem on foot at 8 o'clock a.m. and reached Newburyport in five hours. Remained there one hour when he started for Salem and arrived here at 8 p.m., performing the whole journey 48 miles in 12 hours, including the stoppage of one hour at Newburyport. Newburyport. There was no wager to stimulate him, and his only objective was amusement. Pedestrianism. That is old timey. I'm on the lookout for more pedestrianism relics. That, that little morsel was hidden away in this 1820, June 20th, the Union. What other historical morsels does this newspaper hold? Well, keep watching and find out. Thanks for checking in.